I suffer from various uh, illnesses, uh, mainly mental health issues such as depression, anxiety, um, body dysmorphia, um, and I also suffer from bulimia. Um, it's been quite difficult at King's, just struggling with being able to explain to people things that are, are kind of not talked about a lot. What do you wish you had known before you enrolled? I kind of wished that I'd known how much support was actually available. I was not aware of the transition events that are available for people um, with kind of mental health conditions which allowed them to come in early and kind of experience the campus before you kind of got the whole rush. Strategies for managing life at university. So I think that the most important strategies for kind of dealing with your time at university alongside these problems is really just interacting with people and I've talked to my lecturers and kind of find out that these problems and these kind of situations weren't new to them. They had had many students who had been in exactly the same position and they kind of had a set protocol um, for what kind of the things they do to help you deal with it. So I found that the kind of mitigating circumstances form um, was actually really helpful for me because um, I, the first time I used it, I just went to my lecturer who um, was going to be marking that piece of coursework and I said, I can't do this in time. Um, is there any way around it? Is there any way I can ask for extra days and that kind of thing? She sent me the form over email. I sent it to SPLAS and kind of three days later they approved it. Lecture capture has actually been really helpful this year just because there's been so many lectures where I've completely missed them. Um, so it's been really helpful um, just to be able to do it kind of whenever I reach a point where I, where I can begin doing things again to have that kind of resource. Also set up a support network at uni just because I spend a lot more time here than I spend anywhere else. Um, so it's really helpful um, to have someone that's always available whenever I need it it's because I know that there will always be someone there who can help. Positive advice for incoming students. The one piece of advice that um, I would kind of offer is don't worry about feeling kind of out of place or not having people that understand or being embarrassed or ashamed of things um, because there are kind of hundreds of people who are kind of just an email away and are completely willing to do anything that is going to help you and your studies.